okay let's see find the x right now here uh, this also you have to use alternate segment theorem and uh, before that hmm, uh, okay i will not draw another uh, circle to explain this hmm. now this is cyclic quadrilateral no i mean uh, b f e d right this is cyclic quadrilateral very clear uh, all the vertices on the circumference so that's why this is a cyclic quadrilateral right b f e d right this is cyclic quadrilateral now we learn in a cyclic quadrilateral opposite angle supplementary right that means uh, add up to 180 now if this is 80 this should be 100 right these are the opposite angle of this cyclic quadrilateral now so that's why if this is 8 this should be 100 okay now what i try to do here now i need to get x right i need to find x so what i try to do what are the angle i could find i will find those first right then uh, then you will realize what the uh, we can ma make another method get to x value right uh, when you uh, find some other uh, angles uh, they ask to find x but with this angle but let's see find other stuff other angles then you can come to this one right okay then uh, here now okay i will not turn if you turn this one this paper you can understand uh, what the way is but uh, i will show you this way because uh, then that also uh, important for you uh, right same way now the look here ca this is the tangent right this is a tangent at this uh, in this tangent or the tangent point b at this b they make another chord bf this is the chord you need to consider right even this is a chord be bd those are chord but we need to consider here uh, f because uh, this chord and the tangent between we have x right now if this is x mm, right now what the theorem we learn alternate segment theorem now here tangent uh, this is the chord bf this chord subtended angle at circumference like this right so this angle will be this one will be equal to this right try to understand if this is x this will be equal to this right uh, that means here also x right okay what the uh, uh, theorem here this is the uh, tangent tangent uh, and between tangent and the chord this angle will be equal to that chord subtended angle at the circumference right in a uh, this type of situation whether you have tangent and chord chord make at the tangent point at that type of situation but the angle between tangent and the chord that means this x like x this will be equal to this chord subtended angle at circumference right so uh, this is a little difficult to understand uh, for some so that's why I explain it more here x then here also x right now they tell no this is isolated triangle that means bf equal to fe they tell no in the data so that's why now this is isolated triangle in isolated triangle we have two side equal that two side hmm, opposite angle that means this side opposite angle this one this side opposite angle is this one so if this is x this will be x right but the theorem we learn in isolated triangle uh, angle of the equal sides right we have two sides you know angle of the equal sides those angles also equal right opposite of the uh, equal sides huh? opposite angle of the equal side those two angles also will be equal so if this is x this is also x okay now we can write what the x plus x plus 100 will be uh, 180 because interior angle of a triangle huh? b f e triangle this is interior angle no so you can write x plus x plus 100 will be equal to 180 right now you can slow here 2x here 100 equal 180 right now i will keep 2x here i will bring this 100 to this side right 180 minus 100 right that's how no we slow uh, equation right we need to find unknown value right okay then here 2x equal 180 minus 100 mean 80 degrees now this 80 we, we need x right not 2x so to remove this 2 i will divide both side by 2 so to, to cut here x will be equal to 40 degrees so 
value of x is 40 degree.